Some of you may have heard of an author by the name of Ian Watson. If you haven't, where have you been? <laughs> this is a collection of stories that link together tell one story. It's written by Mr. Ian Watson and by the slightly taller of Roberto Qualia. Now, as I say, for those of you who don't know Ian Watson, <laughs> there you go. And Roberto, for those of you who don't know Roberto, has just been awarded Best International Writer at Eurocom. European. Oh, European yeah. writer. Sorry. Okay. So there you go. So two award-winning authors have produced this stunning book, which basically tells a very unusual love story. And without getting too involved and giving too much away, it is basically about a woman-sized tumour which has bedtime stories read to it, sort of Arabian Nights, and the stories appear as tattoos upon it. And in this book, you will learn many fascinating things, such as the story of the very first moon voyage, which was carried out by Vlad the Impaler using the revolutionary impalement drive. <laughs> you will also learn everything you wanted to know about the um, Gigagola? Uh, Jigger lens. Jigger lens. The, the Jigolo Golem, which I'm sure will be fa fascinating to all of us. You will also learn about how Google becomes god Google and becomes self-aware, not only finding and searching out things that are, but creating things that should be. All these and more are here for the intrepid readers to read about in The Beloved of My Beloved. Oh, yeah, well, yeah, this is normal in England. In the time of Shakespeare, for example, it was obligatory to know Italian in order to be able to steal your plots. <laughs> I can translate it um, um, for, for the Italians uh, which are here. Uh, so actually, we conceived this book in an empty hotel at the border between Czech Republic and Hungary, uh, in a hotel which, which pretended actually to be a hotel and was not really a hotel, probably. Uh, because Darth Bader was late at breakfast and we started to d discuss about virtual necrophilia. 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 As you do at breakfast. Why is it Yes. Uh, and uh, one thing led to another. So finally, I, I found on an Italian motorway uh, this uh, very touching number plate, which you can put uh, uh, on your car. Uh, and in view of um, uh, how we have created uh, John Key, the first ever full-length fiction book written by two people with different mother tongues and different tongues. Uh, per sempre insieme, forever together. Oh. Oh. <coughs> I, I, I was slightly moved myself. Oh. <laughs>